got most of our stuff last week, but that's okay. Thank you for joining. Let's I'm get started. <laughs> Let's get started. I'll get started. This is my favorite right now. It is a mascara by Thrive Cosmetics. It's fabulous. It actually separates your lashes and lengthens them. It's what I'm wearing on my lashes right now. And uh, Tara thinks it's a cheap toy. Um, Thrive Cosmetics is great. It's an actually a woman-owned company that supports um, a women in need. Thrive Cosmetics. All right, well, one of my monthly favorites that I got is this MAC Highlighter Palette. It's simply beautiful. Hold on, hold your horses. It's gonna be really shiny. Oh my gosh, look at that. You wanna see? <laughs> <laughs> great, as your face. Oh, wow. Oh, it's so shiny. It's so pretty. It's got three highlights on it. And also, I don't know if it's the light's good enough in here, but do you see all the reflection? That's not my healthy glow, that's this. So you should check it out. I think Alice does have a healthy glow though. <laughs> this is on Gato's favorite. He's going bananas on it already. I'll turn it back on. This was one of his Christmas presents um, that he actually got. You can check out the video on my channel. But as you can see, he thinks it's the greatest thing ever. I got it off of Amazon. Or I mean, Santa Claus got it off of Amazon. Great. Oh, oh. <laughs> Get it? What do you want to do with it? Gonna make noise. Chimps love making noise. It's their favorite thing. They want to just make as much noise as possible. Volley, Volley's monthly favorite. Can we bring this up yeah. right now? It's okay. the llama corn. It's the llama corn. Oh, you gotta push the button. I know. Here you go, buddy. It's your hatchy mail. It's, it's hard. Oh, oh, there it goes. grows all kinds of like little blocky things that you put through I'm sure there's technical words for them but I don't know they work yeah that's hard <gasps> Doc Anto's monthly favorites <laughs> is these amazing chocolates I think everybody's monthly favorites are these <laughs> they're really pretty I would show you the whole thing. Unfortunately, it has been eaten. <laughs> oh, oh, Molly's got, Molly's got one. It's delicious. He loves it too. <laughs> These are gourmet chocolates. They're from a company called Chocolate Alchemy. The Healer Collection. It's fabulous. That B word. The B word? Yeah. There's a B on it. Vulgar, no. <laughs> That's whatever that is, that's what they call it. within seven to ten days so it's super fresh and absolutely amazing yeah oh i love it it's a weird combination if you look at all the combinations they have you might think you wouldn't like them but i swear every one of them tastes amazing all right one of my one of my other monthly favorites is is <laughs> this fancy sweater i bet you all were wondering where you could get one of these so unicorn on the front unicorn on Yes, I got this from my secret Santa. Um, it's only one of a kind. You can only get it from your secret Santa. So oh, it's too bad. Well, best luck next year. Yep. Let's see. So this is something that I found that I really enjoyed, and I taste tested on some of the employees here, and they absolutely loved it. 
So instead of a garbanzo bean hummus, this is a lupini bean. Why choose a lupini over a garbanzo or chickpea? Um, it has less carbs, it has less calories, and it actually has 50% more protein. <laughs> so, and it's a different flavor, you're just looking for something else. Um, I bought it on Amazon. It comes just like this. It doesn't have to be refrigerated until after you open it and everyone thoroughly enjoyed it. And it pairs well with these other monthly favorites, which are pretzels, and they taste like everything bagels, and they're gluten-free. And so let's just oh, yeah. okay. do okay. this. You okay. Yeah, I think you're probably needing some. And then you dump it, dip it, dip it, <laughs> dump it. Here, Bali, would you like to taste the dip dump part? There you go. Mm. He's eating some of the, the, the bagel whatever. I haven't tried it yet. You have it? on the bagel. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's very good. It's different. Um, it actually has good. These are more um, uh, mm. the good stuff. Fiber. It has like twice the fiber of edamame too. Um. Look, she even painted all of her colors. Oh, mm, it's beautiful. Good job, Tara. You did swatches. It is. <laughs> the palette that I have on my eyes right now. It's, fab it's fabulous. It does have a little bit of fallout, but I don't care about that. Just brush it away, mm -hmm. brush it away, brush it away. Um, so another one of my monthly favorites is skincare. It's Egg Mellow Cream. Um, this is a five in one. Um, this is a Four. five in one for brightening and anti-wrinkle properties. So it's a toner, it's a serum, it's a moisturizer, and for any areas that might be a little more wrinkly, you just add extra. Um, it's kind of really convenient, and it smells really good, and it's a Korean brand. Is that Korean mm -hmm. Beauty? Yeah, Korean Beauty, it's of course. Beauty? Yeah, you got oh, it. Oh, we gotta, gotta try it out on Bali. <laughs> you know, Bali wants to have some good moisturized skin. Oh, yeah. What does it smell like, Bali? Mm -hmm. Mm, I like it. smell like anything. Is that you? you? Let's get your chin. No dry chin here. No dry eyebrows. Ugh, you look fabulous. What about baby monkey? Oh, you want some? Okay. Is it, is it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, you're so pretty. Oh, look at your glowy. Oh, so pretty. Give me your hands. It makes his heart prettier. Huh? Yeah. All right. Okay. I got this. These are my faves. They're sunglasses. I love the Revo brand. Don't I look fabulous? Get one. You look pretty fabulous. Thanks. Kind Let's of looks like Volley looks fabulous. Like Matrix guy. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah he looks good. Oh, looking good, Volley Jim. <laughs> everybody play and it's just like it sounds it's hot potato with a shock um we will demonstrate now i have to demonstrate now yep mm -hmm. you're participating okay okay 
Oh wait, on. Are you putting this on regular or extreme? This is gonna be on normal mode because China is an amateur at it. Um, <laughs> so we have to ease her into it. Okay. Start. It is not super shocking, but I promise you if you play this game at home, everyone will be laughing. So I would say the first time we used it, it was already worth the price. <laughs> Take Although time. I'm not Take sure if you should throw it's okay. it on the tile floor. We don't have to test it. No, no, we have to test it. <laughs> How you doing there? Okay. Okay, she's got it. Okay. Okay. You have to hold it for a couple of seconds. You can't be a weenie about you it. You can't hold it. <laughs> Did it shock you? Not yet. <laughs> Amazon. It's really cool and unique and very interesting, um, kind of psychological. Um, I really liked it. Um, and the next season's going to be even better. So I, I suggest it watching it. It's very, very good. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> what did you watch? Oh, okay. I've, been wa I've been watching Stargate Universe, which is pretty awesome. It's a continuation of the Stargate series. Um, they're on a spaceship that was created by the ancients. And they gotta get home, and they don't know how. It's really cool. You should watch it. Wait, is that how the super sh superhero show you're watching? Nope, I'm watching Agents of Shield, but I'm not done yet because it's got seven seasons. I'm only on season oh, six. Man. We'll talk about that later. I am not watching any television shows right now, but I did start re-listening to The Golden Spruce. Um, it was written by John Valiant. He's written only three books, but I recommend all three: The Golden Spruce, The Jaguar's Children, and The Tiger: A True Story of Vengeance and Survival. And uh, that book is spectacular because it's tigers hunting poachers. So I would say check them all out. You read a book. I read. <laughs> what did I read? I heard you paint. I heard you paint houses, which is um, I don't know if any of you saw The Irishman on Netflix with Robert De Niro and Al Pacino, but it's the story of the guy who killed Jimmy Hoffa, which is um, 1970s mafia, um, but this is the true story and the accounts and the things that went on during the mafia. It was pretty awesome. Um, I suggest listening to it. Um, I listened to Son of a Black Sword, which is magic and mayhem. And then I listened to The Other Daughter, which was a really good story about um, a woman whose daughter had been stolen and it had a, a twisty thriller. Huh. Mm -hmm. And The Sister-in-Law, which also had a little twisty side note about um, a woman who had been married to her husband for 10 years. And she meets her brand new sister-in-law, who she never heard of before. And there's some twisty, twisty. Oh, that sounds, that sounds pretty epic. I also watched Selena. Um, I don't know if any of you guys like the movie Selena with Jennifer Lopez, but I watched the TV series on Netflix that was done. And it was done really well. I really enjoyed it. Um, Definitely the era I was raised in was Selena, so I liked it. It was worth watching, but Wilds is way better. Yeah. So I would watch that next. Um, the only movie that Volley and I and Bayavon watched this month okay. is the um, we watched The Tenant, which was really cool. It's done by the same company that did Inception, and it's all about um, a CIA futuristic. It's like James Bond on LSD. You guys should check it out. Ooh. And that's kind of what COVID has done to us, is all the movies have been released on TV that we're now watching. Yeah, which is awesome for us, because yeah. we get them right away. We don't have to go anywhere! <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And we want to wish you a happy, happy new year, and hope your holiday season was good. And of course, leave a comment down below and let us know what your monthly favorites were for December. And we'll see you in the, in next, the next one. one. Bye, bye, guys. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.